Hello, hello, hello. Oh my goodness, I'm doing something wrong here. Just want to wish everybody a happy Sunday. Uh, today is January the 16th. Yes. <clears throat> come on in, come on in, come on in. And welcome to our Sunday Night Live. Yes, every Sunday I'm here uh, on my personal page and my business page going live trying to sell this $5 jewelry. Okay? Yes, this is again Joanna's Jazzy Jewel. Mm. Let's try and make sure I Put it in so everybody can join in on my live. I'm going to wait and try and get some of those individuals to come on in and watch. So what I do, for those of you who uh, have never shot with me before, I show jewelry. I assign the jury a number. Then after the number, um, if you see something you like, and let's say the number is five, You'll say Jazzy5 in the comment section. That will alert me that you want that particular item. At the end of the live, I'm going to... What I will do is I will um, get your email address. And then uh, I will send you an invoice. And then the invoice will tell you how I will receive payment. Okay? Alright. Sounds like a winning plan. All right. Hello, Miss Linda Coley. How are you tonight? Good evening. Good evening. I pray that uh, everyone's had a good uh, good day so far. Yeah, I was thinking I was at church and I, I said, Jack Gia and uh, Jack Jr. Frost is, is in him. But anyway, it was cold. You know, colder than, than the norm for this part of uh, of the country. So, um, that's great that you're doing fine. So glad that you can make it out um, on tonight, make it out with us. So, so glad about that. I hope, I hope Miss Jewel will be on shortly. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, I, again. I just like, I think about my mom in this life and I just laugh. Because she, she makes it. She makes it just go to a whole nother level. But again, um, I don't have any Z piece. I have them, but I don't know why I don't show them. Maybe on the next live, I'll show some Z pieces. Uh, those are the $25 signature pieces that Paparazzi has uh, put out. So we'll, maybe we'll do that, okay, later on. On tonight, I do have a couple of Valentine's Day uh, pieces. Or I'll say, just say Valentine's pieces. We do have some. I'm going to be showing some that I uh, showed on Friday night, uh, those that were not sold. So, um, And then I'll be showing some more later on, okay? All right, let's get this party started. And we do know that tonight is the giveaway night that I do ask questions. You know, <laughs> I want to say this. My mother said, she said, why don't you ask the hard questions? You keep going by them. There she is. She says, why don't you ask the hard ones? I said, okay. So y'all can thank her. <laughs> Y'all can thank her tonight if I ask some stuff that you didn't even know was in the scriptures, okay? Because that might happen. So we're going to get started out with these nice, um, these steel gray earrings here. Uh, they say, um, do they say black? That's because they are dark silver, dark, dark gray, okay? But as you can see, these are some hoop earrings and they do have the heart on the inside, all right? The number for this one is going to be... Uh, Jazzy 88. Hello, Miss Jewel. Jazzy 88 for these nice hoop earrings uh, that you see there that have the heart uh, on the inside. Okay? Put them on. That's how they're going to look on. So, uh, very, very nice. Okay? Also in line with the um, Valentine's Day theme, I want to show you all this nice pair of pink earrings. This is also a hoop. But this is a pink hoop, and it's called Hearts Throbbing Twinkle. Okay, they do have some little flecks. If you look real close, uh, you will see them in there. But they are heart earrings, okay? Paparazzi does make some large. You have, they'll come across with a small one every now and then. 
for the most part, we have these large earrings, all right? So that is Jazzy 47. Jazzy 47. Now, I want to say that sometime in uh, the, the past, I don't know, five, six months ago, I, I think someone won it as a, I'm pretty sure, someone won this little red ring. I want to say it was uh, Miss Barbara Reddick. I need to uh, type in her. I, I need to get her attention. I'm not sure if it was her, but I'm thinking that it was. She won this little red ring. The red ring had flecks in it. Well, guess what, ladies? Paparazzi came out with this two-piece bracelet set that matches perfectly with that ring, okay? Because the ring, I remember the ring having the little light blue flecks in it. So, Miss Barbara, if you're watching, and it may be one of you all, the other ones, I don't know, but I'm thinking it was her. If you're watching, this is the bracelet that will go perfectly with that ring. And it is a stretch bracelet. It doesn't have uh, the clasp on it. It's a stretch bracelet, two-piece. I'm telling you, I wish now I had kept that ring, because guess what? And paparazzi does that from time to time. One of my up well, no, I only have one upline person. She said she kept something a whole year before paparazzi came out with the match to it. A whole year. So, ladies, some of that stuff you may have bought already, a match may be coming soon. The number for this lovely, um, uh, here again, this two-piece bracelet, and it looked odd. The ring was odd, but I tell you, it matches perfectly. The number for this is uh, Jazzy34. Jazzy34. For whoever has that ring, I'm telling you, it's a perfect match. All right. Now I want to show you this nice, lovely. Oh, uh, after this, we're going to do our first question. Okay, and again, you can thank Miss Jewel for some of these hard questions. She said, ask the hard ones. Ask the hard ones. Okay, we're going to see. Uh, this is a nice, lovely, it, it says pink, um, but it looks a little peachy to me. Even looking at it, it, it just looks peach. It's more of a peach than it is a pink, in my opinion. Uh, the name of this one is called Oceanside Service. Uh, this, uh, here you see the chain is on the, um, a box chain there uh, kind of heavy uh, then it has a chain in the middle and then it has these outer layers there with the silver spaces in between these iridescent stones okay so this is different ladies it does come with the complimentary earrings uh, that match okay so that's very very nice it doesn't have the two inch extender on it it just claps so this is going to be a short necklace okay but I think that's very neat, very chic. The number for this is going to be Jazzy 14. Jazzy 14 for this one. Okay. That is different, y'all. That's 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 a little rich right there to me. That is definitely different. This one is when you wear this, it's gonna be a real addition to your wardrobe. And real meaning that it's gonna add a little class to it. That's just my opinion. Okay. Just my opinion. What does my opinion matter? Eh, to me, it's everything, I guess. All right, number one, the first question. And remember, for those who haven't um, played this game with us before, what happens, I ask a question from the scriptures. And the first person to answer get two questions correctly, they have a chance to win a free gift, okay? They have to choose between one of five bags. Uh, if they choose something they don't think particularly about it, they get an opportunity to choose a second bag. However, whatever is in the second bag, they have to keep it. And sometimes there are good things and sometimes there are just less things that are not so good, okay? Well, all of it is good, but some more than others, okay? First question. What possession of Naboth did Ahab uh, covet? Oh, does it say cover? Cover, I'm sorry. Got to get. Okay, let me look at this. Nope, that was covet. <laughs> ah! I'm telling you. Y'all get y'all, so he can't see, get you some glasses. You can get your glasses, get you a magnifying. What possession of Naboth, N-A-B-O-T-H, did Ahab covet? I don't think that's a hard one, but I got it wrong, but. I don't think that's a hard one. Okay. But anyway, so Ahab wanted something that Naboth had. 
And the Bible said he covered it, okay? Which means he would have done some evil to get it, all right? Okay, so I'll let y'all think of his house. <laughs> Who that said why? Okay, because... Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you right now, don't nobody want Jezebel. <laughs> don't know. <laughs> Sometimes I don't think I don't think I don't think he did. So it wasn't a wife, and it wasn't. Can you be a little bit more specific when you say Langan? What what his children know? <laughs> no, can y'all can you be a, a little bit more? Okay. I'm 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 gonna let you go with that. It, it was his vineyard. His okay. So Linda Cole is saying land, and you'll find the answer to that question in First Kings, um, twenty one. Okay. So like, <laughs> I don't think nobody wanted this. So we okay. We you got it. You got it. You got the um. No, she said the grapes. Okay, his vineyard. The grapes are in the vineyard. Okay. All right, so <laughs> okay, so Miss Linda, you got one. Sister Linda, you got one. Okay, <laughs> y'all said the children in land cattle. Okay, she was the first person to say that. Yeah, but that wife, I don't think, I don't think. <laughs> that poor woman had um, who was it, Elijah? She had him crying under that tree. She was <laughs> uh, mm mm. I, I wouldn't want to fool with her, but I don't know. Let me, I don't know. <laughs> she was something um, serious. You hear me? You going to have a prophet crying. You somebody. All right, let's look at this one. This one is, um. we'll do this. We'll ask another question in a little bit, okay? So <laughs> this one, this is a green necklace. You do see uh, that little clouded area in there that's supposed to be in there, those swirls in there. Very, very pretty. But then you see here, you see the rhinestones. I'm going to bring it in close. And it has a green pearl. Now, y'all, that is nice. And then you have the iridescent white um, stone there, too. And up here, too, the spacer. So that's cute. And it does come with the complimentary green earrings. See where the little pearl earrings there? Oh, that is a wonder. Okay. Nice green necklace. The number for this is going to be Jazzy One. Jazzy one, okay, all right. That one, that one is different. If you got, if you like, y'all, green is green used to be my favorite color, but green is one of my favorite colors. I think hot pink is is number one, and purple, but I like green too. I'm a even the people at work like you. Why you like green? And I was like, I didn't know I liked green like that, but I do. I, I knew it, but I didn't know I was. They knew it. Yeah, let me say it that way. I didn't know they knew it. Okay, this next item is called the Arctic Affluence. This is a silver bracelet. Look at this, ladies. This does have, um, here again, has those little flecks inside of the bracelet. And you have your silver spacers. So this one is indeed different too this is a stretch um bracelet there i think that's unique look at look at that look again those flecks in there that gives the illusion that there are clouds inside of this bracelet and the number for it is 79 jazzy 79 okay that's nice if you got i had a y'all know what y'all had things I, I i had a gray sweater I don't know what happened to my gray sweater. I wish I could find it. I have so many things uh, that I could wear with it. Yes. The next item is called Twisted Twinkle. And it is a silver bracelet there with the rhinestones. The bracelet itself is twisted. That's why it's called Twisted Twinkle. And along in some of the grooves, there are rhinestones that have been strategically placed there. Okay, so that when you wear it on your arm, put it on your arm, and it is a cuff bracelet, uh, it's going to show. Okay, I think that is so feminine and delicate. This is a delicate bracelet. It's very, very lightweight. 
Uh, it'll be um, great if you're going out for a night on the town. Okay, or if you're like me, you're just going to Chick-fil-A and coming right back. Jazzy 55. Y'all don't want to wear that Chick-fil-A though. Jazzy 55. Okay. Now, I did show this one the other night. So, if you're having a deja vu moment, there's nothing wrong with you at all. It's just the replay. And this here is a silver necklace, a short silver necklace. It does have a two-inch extender. does come with the complimentary uh, earrings there. does have the lobster class. This is a heart within a heart. I think that's what I named this on the other night. Uh, but the actual paparazzi name for this is called Bless Your Heart because it has the three hearts inside there. You have one with the rhinestones, then you have your silver plated heart, and then you have, well, you have the red rhinestones, and then you have the white clear rhinestones. So this is a three piece. It's mobile too because they do, they are actually inside each other. All right, have nothing against those earrings, as I always say, but I do want to say this. These earrings, I think, add value to the necklace because guess what? It is a heart within a heart also, and it has the red rhinestones. So this one kind of brings out um, and completes the look, in my opinion. This is a two-piece deal. The total for it is ten dollars and eighty cents. Because you know you got to get that, you got to get those, get that sales tax added in there. The number for this nice two-piece is gonna be Jazzy sixty-six. Y'all, this is nice, Jazzy sixty-six. Hello, Evangelist Snipes. Thank you for joining. Thank you for joining. Okay. For y'all just coming in, you can go back, watch the replay. Uh, I have shown some pieces already. Some of it you maybe you've seen before. Maybe you haven't. Okay. So, here's our second question. Linda Cole is leading the pack with one. Which city did... High L Rebuild. And the guy's name is H-I-E-L. High L. Which city did High L Rebuild? Okay. It's going to be coming out of First Kings. That's all I'm going to say about that. If you think about it, you'll get it. Just think about it. Sometimes we overthink things. I know some. I can take a test and I'll be like, oh, that ain't the answer. So which city? Uh, Babylon. Okay. <laughs> it wasn't Babylon. I know that's what you're <laughs> I know that's what you're trying to say. But it wasn't Babylon, okay? <laughs> it wasn't Babylon and it wasn't Babylon. So... That was not the correct man. Good try, though. Good try, Miss Jewel. Good try. All right. While y'all thinking of the answer, I'm going to move on to the next one. I just get tickled at her answer. Okay. <laughs> but she's she going to mess around and, and win something, though. This next piece is a copper. Okay. Well, and it, it was a Jerusalem. Good try. Um, It's called Ben Oval uh, Backwards. This is a nice copper necklace here. As you can see, um, no, it was Jericho. It was thank you, Evangelist Knight, and and it do have an H in it. <laughs> oh, Jericho. Okay, Jericho. All right, I got you down. That's one for Evangelist Knight. It's one for Linda Coley. All right. So this is the, this um nice copper necklace. Then over backwards here, you see the ovals in there, and they some of them do have the hammered out uh, texture on it. I matched it up with this nice uh, copper cuff bracelet, as you can see here, okay? And it does uh, have, okay, it looks like they took a braid on it and then came back out. So this is a two-piece deal. If you want to split it up, that's quite all right with me. No problems, no problems, no problems. And the number for this is going to be 85, Jazzy 85. If you just want the bracelet, you'll say 85 bracelet. Okay, let me send a wave when people come on. If you want the necklace, you'll say 85 necklace. If you want them both, you'll say 85 set. Okay, all right. So we got, again, we got um, Evander's Night with one point and then... 
We have uh, Sister Lynn Nicola with 1.1 on 1. We're going to see who's going to get our first prize. All right, before we get there, I'm going to show this set, and then we're going to ask another question, see who can get it. This one is called the Main Course, M-A-N-E. Uh, Mel, are you trying to watch? Why are you trying to watch? Okay. All right, this is a dark gray here that's still gray color, and it has the hammered out te texture, and then it just has some raised um, coverings there. On, look at this. This is kind of cute. Kind of reminds me of some African print with the fan. It does come with your complimentary uh, matching earrings. does have a two inch extender, so you can extend it out two inches more. And what I've done is added um, a bracelet, bangle bracelets. Oh, you sleepy? Well, wake up, okay? Wake up and look at some jewelry, answer some questions, win some free jewelry. That's what we do here on Joanna's Jazzy Jewel. All right, so we got a two-piece deal here. Again, $5 for the bracelet, $5 for the um, the necklace. And let's see, you get one, two, three, four, five, six. This is seven bracelets, okay? Seven, all for $5. And y'all, you can stack them, get, you know, you can take some off. Remember, you don't have to wear them all. Two-piece deal, that's $10.80. And the number for that is going to be Jazzy61. Jazzy 61. That's a cutie, too. I do think so, if I don't say so myself. All right. Let's see. Next question. Uh, how old? This is easy. Y'all remember this. Y'all remember this one. How old was Joseph when he was sold into Egypt? Oh my goodness, I heard a preacher preach, uh, I think it was Saturday, Friday or Saturday. And, they, and, and the person was talking about Joseph. They was talking about everybody who was in captivity. And how we, through our pain, you know, God has ministry. And through the things that we go through, how he just turns that to our favor. Oh my goodness, and it was so such a blessing. Okay, he was not 13. <laughs> he definitely wasn't 30. <laughs> oh, how old was he? Nope, he wasn't 12. How old was Joseph when he was sold into Egypt? Okay. And that's going to be in the 37th chapter of Genesis. How old was he? I'm going to say he wasn't an adult yet. 17, yes. So I saw Linda Coley with the correct answer first. And then Evangelist Snipes came in. But 17, that woman said 8. 17, 17. All right, Miss Coley, you've got two. So you can um, tell me you know the drill, one through five. Okay. Yeah, he was just a teenager. 17 years old. But he had to go through that to get to where he was going. And that's what I think Stephen uh, Furtick was the, um, I know thinking and I know he was the preacher that I was listening to who was preaching on that. Oh, that thing blessed me. It blessed me something serious. Okay. Okay, number five. <laughs> and she called on the Lord. She said, All right, so here it is. Now, we've, I've had these. I have several of these, actually. So, if you see something, ladies, that um, that is giving, being given away as a free gift and you like it, you also can um, purchase it. I do have another one of these, so I, I know when I was looking at my stash tonight. 
Okay, so Miss Linda Kohler, let me show you what you want. Okay, this is a long, you might already have it. This is a long chain here. Uh, it is green. Don't, now nah, Marilyn, don't be like that. You just don't, don't. Look, we all have fun on this channel, on this live. We do it every Sunday, so you know. Okay, so this is green, and you have your silver, and then that has the uh, hammered out detail in it, and then just a regular silver bead. So if you like this one, that is the only thing that's in this particular bag, in bag number five. And like I said, you may have this one already. It does come with your complimentary earrings there. So if anyone wants to purchase one of these, you can do so also. So y'all think she should keep it, or y'all think she should trade it in for something else? Let me know, okay? Let her know, rather. You want to keep it? Okay. So, let me put your name in here. I should just have y'all, y'all, uh, the regular people cards already and just throw it in there. All right. I got you. You want to keep it? No problem. Okay. So, <laughs> I ain't going to say nothing. I ain't going to say nothing. She need him, you need him, I need him, we all need him. I tell you what, if we need the Lord, you hear me? I'm serious. <laughs> oh, that tickled me more than I'm laughing. Okay, so let's show the next one. <laughs> let's show the next one. This is I like this. This is called the I Love You <clears throat> heart. This is what I'm gonna call it anyway. Because it has the word, it has the little symbol for the I and then the U, and of course the heart here. Um, is is the part that goes in the middle. So this is the I love you. Yes, we all need Jesus. This is the I love you. Did you see Mama's coming? I ain't gonna say nothing. I ain't gonna say nothing though. Okay, so uh, has the rhinestones there. This is a long chain, a little small chain here. Uh, very very cute. It does come with the complimentary. Um, especially all of us. That's right. It comes with the studs here. Does have a two inch extender, although it is a long uh, necklace. So, what I've done because of all of the bling that you see there, I have added. I did show this one on Friday too. I have added this ring uh, to go along with this, okay? And as a third piece, I um, showed this bracelet here silver bracelet with all of those heart charms on it and those silver beads okay so this is a three-piece deal you have your bracelet you have your necklace and you have your ring okay all right so for this particular set is going to be jazzy 77 now if you just want the ring you'll say 77 ring if you just want the necklace you'll say 77 necklace and if you want the bracelet 77 bracelet All right, y'all gotta leave Marilyn alone. She said, "You know she right." <laughs> she said she really thought you were cooking, love. She really did. <laughs> oh, love it. You were cooking and holding. He's saying, "Okay, okay." All right, let's move on. Let's go on to our next question. Okay, that was too funny. Let's go on to our next question. All right. <clears throat> Y'all gonna get this one too. This is I uh, this the easy card. I'm supposed to be asking the hard questions. This is the easy card. What situation brought Jesus back to Judea, even though the people there had once tried to stone him? I read the question again. What situation brought Jesus back to Judea, even though the people there had once tried to stone him? But he went back. And this is in St. John. Okay. What was it? Are you answering love is the answer? 
Uh, we're going to be a little bit more specific, okay? Something else brought him back. What brought him back? All right. He's going back to the place where the folks tried to, to heal them. Nah, it was a specific thing coming from that 11th chapter that brought him back to Judea. Came back for a reason. Somebody told him that to come see about somebody. <laughs> now, me, Jewel, you know you just you just saying anything. <laughs> what brought him back? He came back for a specific reason. Somebody requested him to come. All right. That's all I'm going to say about that. I'm going to give the answer away in a minute. All right. While y'all thinking about that, let's look at this right here. This nice petite. This is rhinestones. This is red rhinestones. That's encased with the um, white rhinestones. Okay. It's on the short necklace. It does have a two inch extender, but it is short. Does come with these uh, signature uh, earrings there, okay? Okay, so we see here, this is so cute. He came back for Lazarus, that's exactly right. He came back for the death and Lazarus was sick. So the point goes to Linda Coley, okay? All right, and I just got something from your daughter too. All right, Marilyn, you got it right, but... the Sister Coley beat you to the draw. You got to type in a, you got to type quick, Marilyn. I'm rooting for you. So, ladies, this nice here again, um, this nice red. You got your red rhinestones with the white ones. You also have the red ones encircled inside of this heart a ring. Okay, I think that is just beautiful. And y'all know Valentine's Day is coming up. You can get this nice set for your daughter or for your granddaughter. Or in some people's case, maybe your great-granddaughter. Uh, um, this has the bracelet also that has those red rhinestones. He just came back because Lazarus was sick. And you said them. He just he came back for the one person in this particular time that I'm talking about, Miss Jewel. Not them, just for one person. That one person was Lazarus. All right. So... This here is a three-piece set, as you can see. Now, if you don't want to get the braces, you can get the necklace and the ring. It doesn't matter if you just want the ring or you just want the uh, necklace. The number is Jazzy 63. But, y'all, look at how beautiful that is together. OMG. And, I mean, oh, my goodness. All right. So, a three-piece deal. 63. Let me know. I'm telling you. And that's the only one that I have left. I think I may have one that's a little, but it's not like that, though. I got one that just has a red stone in it, but not like that. That is gorgeous. I may be holding it too close. That is just so cute and feminine to me. A lady, a little lady would wear that. <laughs> that's what I say about that. Now, this next, uh, on this next piece... I'm not going to tell her. Okay, y'all, she, she see it. You didn't get the point on here, but you did. You sure did. Okay. All right. So for this next one, this is a Tiffany-inspired necklace here, and it is brass. Y'all know brass is that dull gold. Okay, and does have a brass heart shape there uh, to go with it. It does have she ain't gonna give you no she ain't gonna give you no credit. Okay. And it does come with the complimentary heart earrings there to go with this necklace. It's a short necklace. Of course the closure is there in the front. That's why I said Tiffany inspired. Uh Tiff uh okay. And I have to match it here. This nice brass bracelet. This is a stretch bracelet there. So this is a two piece deal, okay? Two piece there. If you like it, you're going to say Jazzy 62. 
Jazzy 62 for the bracelet, Jazzy 62 for the necklace, or Jazzy 62 for the set. Okay? And let me add, I do have a ring that I also um, have put with it. I didn't see it till just then. This nice brass ring, okay? That will match with that set also. Jazzy 62. Alright. Now I did show this uh, again. This is an encore or shall I say a replay. This, uh, my, I know my mom bought it. There, It was in black. But this one is blue. Okay. This one is not black. It is blue. Kind of reminds me of the keys on a, a piano or organ. Okay, it does come with the matching complimentary earrings that you see there. It does have a 2-inch extender, as you can see. With it, I have matched it up with this bracelet. It does come with it. It is also blue with the rhinestones down the center. And it's just what I call a hinge bracelet, you know, just a hinge on it. Okay. All right. So, yep, she sure did. And I forgot to tell her she did good, too. Alright, and I've also matched it up with this ring, a three-piece deal. You have your necklace, you have your bracelet, and you have your ring. And the number for this set is going to be Jazzy 11, okay? And if you want to break it up, that's fine. I don't have a problem with it, okay? It's just these two pieces, I would that you would buy them together because they do come and they are a perfect match. They were made for each other, okay? Jazzy Eleven. All right, let's ask the next question. Let's ask the next question. All right. Finish the line from First Corinthians. It is better to marry than what? It is. It is better to marry than what? Miss Jewel, what you saying with this number 11? Well, I tell you what, you might want to answer the question. That's the easy one. Y'all, that's the easy, that's the easy one. Burn, yes. Yes, Miss Jewel, you got it first. I saw it was over here. Okay. So we got Linda Cola with one, and Vanna Snipes with one, and Miss Jewel with one. Everybody got that one right. And again, that's coming from, I saw Miss Jewel with it first, 1 Corinthians 7 and 9. It is better to marry than to burn. Okay? All right. Now, we're finna get this next one. <laughs> I'm fixing that. Now, Miss Jewel, tell me what you wanted to with 11. You want to buy number 11? Is that what you're saying? Let me know what you're talking about. While she's coming in with that, I'm going to show my next uh, item. And then we'll have another question, I guess. This is a little cute. I have the necklace and I have the bracelet to go with this. Let me see what the name of this is. The name of this is called Nautical Nirvana. Nautical Nirvana. And okay, you want number all three pieces? <clears throat> just let me know because you just put 11 up there. Okay, that ain't telling me. You want the set? You want the. Just let me know. <clears throat> so, ladies, this is a pink, almost a pink pearl. Here with an ivory pearl. And then there you have your clear iridescent stone and a silver stone. Okay. This is a short necklace. It does come with a 2 inch extender. The earrings um, are these beads here. These silver studs. Y'all they stuck. Let me unstuck. Un okay. So here I don't know what you're saying Miss Jewel. You ain't you just. So I'm going to give you all three pieces. Okay, necklace and okay, that's what you say, so I can get it. All right, got you. All right, so here again is this piece. Okay, has the different. This bracelet is an exact match. So, ladies, look at that. It's an exact match to the necklace. So, if you're gonna get one, I would that you would get both of them if you just choose to buy this. Okay, so the number for this is going to be Jazzy eighty four. 
for this pink and cream colored necklace and bracelet set. Jazzy 84. All right. Now this next thing before I do the question, um, I want to show I have I have it in silver and then I have it in a multicolor. Okay, I'm gonna show the multicolor first, but I also have it in a silver with a clear color. So this is on a gray chain, a long gray chain down here at the bottom and then you have your multicolored stone there okay and paparazzi world we call that iridescent which is coveted by a lot of people this kind of reminds me of a gym clip or a paper clip or something but it is here again it is different you have your oval there it goes up and it has the complementary earrings they are like the the um, piece that you see in the middle there okay it has the oil spill earrings Again, I don't have anything. I think those earrings are nice. I don't have anything against those earrings. However, I can say that this is a nice upgrade. These earrings were made for this necklace. Look at here. You have that same gym clip thing going on there. You have the same um, oil spill that you have there. You have it inside of the earrings. They are on a fish hook back, uh, needless to say. So I think that will upgrade the ear to this real good. This is a two-piece deal. That's going to be $10.80 for the set. All right. And the number for this particular set is going to be Jazzy 23. Jazzy 23. And again, this comes in a silver and clear. Let me show it to you. And I do have the earrings to go along with it. Just as I did with the uh, oil spill. I have the matching earrings to go along with this one. See, this is just a clear stone there. And it has comes with the complementary earrings there that are clear to match. It does have a 2-inch extender on this long chain. And the earrings, needless to say, they are on a fish hook back also. Same as with the oil spill. And they will be here again, a nice complement to this. Even though one of them is jacked up. <laughs> As the young folks would say, it's jacked up. Let me let me get it out of jail. Okay. There. Now, these are the earrings that go with it, as you can see. Again, they're on a fish hook back. Okay. That's a nicer compliment. We have it in oil spill, and then we have it in this clear white. So the number for this one is going to be Jazzy 51. If you just want the earrings, you'll say 51. Ear. If you want the whole entire thing, you'll say 51 set. That's just a two-piece there. Okay? All right. Next question. This was the easy. I, I did that disclaimer about the hard question, so I guess I have to ask them next Sunday if we leave. This is the, this one's easy. This, y'all gonna get this real, real easy. Ready? Who had a wife forced upon him by the deceit of his own uncle? Who had a wife forced upon him by the deceit of his own uncle? Y'all remember that story? I need a bag. Somebody had a wife forced upon him. Nope, not Hosea. <laughs> Hosea kept fussing himself on his wife. <laughs> now you talking about a man losing somebody kept taking them back. Every time I read that story, my heart bleed for... For um uh, anyway, <laughs> no Hosea wasn't wasn't the uh it's not the the answer. If I if I go to tell the story, y'all gonna get it. Who had a wife forced upon him by his uncle Jacob? Let me see who was the first person. 
on my side to say Jacob because Jacob is the correct answer. Okay. When you do this thing, you have to go. Yeah, it'll take you all the way back sometimes when I hit it. Okay, Evelyn's Knight was the first one to say Jacob on my end. Okay. Who is raw? Okay, so Evelyn's Knight, this is how this is going to go. Well, you know how we do it. Bag number five is all has already been. Bag number five has already been on. Um, been taken by Miss Coley. So you get bag number one through four. Let me know which one you want. All right, three, okay. Three it is. And then we'll, let's see. Okay, number three, number three. Number three has one thing in it. All right, let's see what you got. Got to open it up, open it up. It's the long chain and it is brass. And like I got a thousand of these and it may not even be a thousand. I know I don't have a thousand. I see it look like. Y'all know I know I ain't got a thousand. <laughs> okay. All right. So, what y'all think she should do? This on a long chain. This is a brass. Let me choke it up a little bit. I'm going to pull it up a little bit. This is the emblem that you see there on it. Kind of reminds me of a little bit of the Star of David. Um, there, as you can see, it does come with the complimentary tassel earrings. They are fish hook. They are not clip-on earrings. I show some clip-on earrings on Fridays. <laughs> she said change in all caps. Okay. <laughs> I already knew that was coming. I already knew. So, in order to change, you got to give me the number of a bag. Miss it again too slow. Yep, yep, you missed it again too slow. Okay, Venus Knight, then you got bag two, uh, one, four, and two. One, four, and two. So, while she's making up her mind on one, four, yep, she already said two. Okay, now you know that whatever is in bag number two, you got to take it. Okay, that's the rules of the game. Whatever's in the second bag that you choose, you gotta take it. Okay, and I'm gonna put my disclaimer out there. If you don't like it, don't tell me. <laughs> if you, it's one item. If you don't like it, what I say, don't tell me. Alright, you know what? I got some, um... I got a bracelet to go with this. Alright. Even this night, this is what you have worn. This is a white drop necklace. As you can see here, has the white comes down here. And then it has, you see, the silver spaces there. It's a long necklace. Does come here with your complimentary earrings. They are white there. The stuff, so this is what you want from Joanna's Jazzy Jewel. I think I got some earrings with that on it, too. All right, okay, that is that. Is that now? I want to show y'all. I have another piece before I show you my final piece. I want to say, No, you're welcome. Thank you for joining. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what you're saying, Miss Jewel, but I, I got a feel I don't want to know. But anyway, 
I want to show y'all these earrings. These are lovely here. Uh, uh, I did decide to bling things out. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> from salt to sugar I guess that's good then okay alright y'all don't like the little brass anyway I want to show y'all these earrings the number for my earrings is going to be Jazzy 82 my earrings and then here I do have uh, this gray ring to match my gray sweater of course does have the rhinestones there around it okay again all of our rings have the um, stretch back of the accordion back I do want to say uh, to in line with the bling earrings I have this rhinestone bracelet uh, this is a cuff bracelet you just it's very easy to take on and off okay it looks like it's for a little uh, wrist because my wrist is much larger than that and you know I just put it on also I have now this one is beautiful this one is also a cuff bracelet uh, here as you can see but look at it this is gorgeous all right it has the smaller rhinestones is to me is very elegant I can see that little black dress with those heels on and put this on your wrist you'll be very very cute of course this is a four piece deal and you can switch it up you can break it up but this is a smaller bracelet and it is it is just feminine to me it has class and it has to me just a quality piece now this one has the larger rhinestones again and the earrings okay they are pierced earrings 82 jazzy 82 for all four of those pieces okay and then for for the last piece I want to show on tonight it is very I love turquoise I've said that over and over and over again but this is a turquoise and um Oh, my mom is too much. Okay, so <laughs> I'm not gonna. <laughs> okay, I, I I'm just not gonna say anything to that. I'm gonna show this last piece, and we're gonna get off. Okay, so this this right here is a turquoise and brass necklace. If I can get it out, <laughs> if I can get it out. So this is the turquoise pieces that you see here, and it has, <laughs> it has a turquoise um, chain that goes with it. Y'all look at these little cute earrings. I, aren't they darling? And it matches the necklace great with the bees and the little coils, turquoise there. I think that is so cute. Um, with it, I do have two additional items. It's a three-piece set. Uh -huh. It is a three-piece set. This is a bracelet. It does have um, the chain on it. Uh, it is the lobster class on it with the chain. Okay, look at this. Okay, I don't know. I just I don't know. I'm just gonna have to pray for it. That's all I can do. So it is does have that on it. Three pieces there. You see, has that. I think is beautiful. I am. I just want to holler, but I'm not going to do it. I'm just trying to hold and maintain. Okay? And then we have this turquoise. You see with the crackle stone on it. This turquoise and brass um, ring here. Okay? I, I, you keep, okay. And so then here's the ring. Alright? So right there, you see, it's a three-piece deal. Alright? All of this turquoise and brass. If you like it, y'all, I have a uh, two or three of these, all right? So, if more than one person wants it, it's fine. The number is going to be Jazzy 46. Jazzy 46. And if you just want the ring, you'll say 46 ring. If you just want the bracelet, you'll, see, you'll say 46 bracelet. If you just want the necklace, you'll say 46 necklace, okay? All right. So, y'all, thank y'all so much. Thank y'all so much for joining joining us on uh, the Jazzy Jewel this week. I want y'all to pray. Pray. We have quite a few people in our church that were not feeling well. So, y'all pray for the members to feel well. Okay? And just pray. I pray y'all have a great night. Um, and y'all just be blessed. Be blessed of the Lord. <clears throat> Oh, 
Oh, Lord, I just, it's just too much, okay? All right, y'all, be blessed, and uh, I'll see y'all next, I'll see y'all next live, okay? All right, bye-bye.